Hey guys, or should I say, hey, it's Bree. Get um ready with me because we're about to go get a Korean facial, an authentic Korean facial. Because I don't know what is going on with my skin. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Basically, I need to wash my makeup off. I just got back home from a date. A date that lasted more than 12 hours. So, shout out to my makeup routine because the face is still giving. Anyway, you guys, let me edit this picture that I want to post on Instagram really quick. I have to do it on the iPad because I need a new phone. Oh my god, my Apple Pencil's on 5%. And then I will wash my face off. And I will talk to you guys about how I fucked my skin up. Let me post this picture on Instagram and I'll come right back. A few moments later. Okay, let's wash this face off. My house looks like shit. I'm probably going to be late to my appointment, but I really don't care. Should I call them? Let me call them. Hi, I have an appointment today at 2.30, but I think I'll be there closer to 2.45 because I'm coming from downtown. Yeah, yeah, it's not okay. It's fine. Okay, I'll see you guys. I just wanted to let you know. Okay. Bye-bye. Okay, see you. I get everything I want. So I went on a date last night, and honestly, I could hang out with that man every day for the rest of my life. Honestly. And it's crazy because before this, I was in a situation ship for like a year. Clearly, I hated myself. The thing is, this boy, my situation ship, he know he got me fucked up. He know he cannot spin a block no more. It's a dub for you. I just gave you opportunity of a lifetime, brother. And I'd be damned I'd be disrespected like this. So I'm 100% in my post that content era. I always am taking pictures. I'm always recording, even if I know I'm not going to post it until like way later. Part of it is I just love memories. That's part of it. I feel like I live a pretty cool life and it should be documented and it should be shared online for other people to consume. Have you guys noticed that um, since I moved into my spot, I've been posting consistently across all my platforms. Can I get my flowers for that? Can I get my tins for that? Or do you bitches hate my motherfucking guts? Is this a whole bunch of hate watching? Matter of fact, thumbs up this video, weird bitch. Thumbs it up right the fuck now, weirdo. Hmm. I'm fucked up. Nah, I'm not. Nigga, I'm fucking real. Anyway, we're gonna wash our face with some La Roche Posay. I'm never coming off this face wash. I love this shit, and you're gonna see why. One pump of this, not even a real pump, like a dime size, is gonna take three layers of foundation, two different kind of concealers. My face is going to come off. That's why I'm not coming off of this. One wash, all my makeup is gone. And then I use this toner right here. This is a Korean toner. Do I need to tone before? Like, I'm not going to do my whole skincare routine if they're literally going to give me a facial. Let me take my chains off. The facial is from here to pretty much the top of my boobs. So I got to take my chains off. Yeah, I definitely will hang out with that guy every fucking day. He liked me so much, he was holding my purse. I'm like, ugh. I'm so happy I'm at a better place in life because this is, this is what the fuck I deserve. Oh my god, I need to get my necklaces cleaned. Ah! Hold on. I'm just really, really happy. Because I'm attracting different kinds of people. I'm getting ready to go on a trip. My first trip of the summer, too. This is just like the first trip. And I just feel like everything is falling into place. My biggest accomplishment right now is that I'm attracting a different kind of man. Like, I love that for me. I'm naked. All right, I'm gonna play some music, but I don't want to get copyright infringement or whatever. So we're just gonna wash our face. Real ass bitch, give a fuck about a nigga. Big freaking bag, hold five, six figures. Stripes on my ass, so we call it pussy tigger. Fucking on a scamming ass, rich ass nigga. Same group of bitches, ain't no ass to the picture. Drop a fuck right, watch his ass get thicker. Tricking on licking, I'm licking at your nigga. If it's money right, he can eat it like a sticker. I ain't got time for this fake ass hoe. Talking all loud in a fake ass clothes. Fake ass shoes, make that fake ass toe. I'm the realest bitch ever to eat snake ass hoe. Act up, you can get snatched up. Y'all see that shit on my nose? And don't act like you can't see it. Hold on. 
Y'all see that shit right there on my nose? And then it's on this side too. It looks so ugly. And then I don't even want to talk about what's going on under my nose because I'm insecure about that too. Like, I got this shit going on on this side of my nostril. I honestly feel like I'm having an allergic reaction to my glasses or something because I don't even know what's going on like on this side of my nose. And then this is like some old ass scar. That's exactly why we're gonna go get a facial because I can't take it. I'm gonna wash my face with this sponge right here. And then we're gonna go. I'm honestly happy that I'm going to go get this facial and my hair is already like two or three weeks old because the last time I went and got a facial I got my hair done literally the same day or like the day before and like whatever they used to like exfoliate my face was all in my lace i had like white shit all in my lace and i didn't care because i was glowing like i was so pretty when i walked out did this eyeliner not come off my fucking face oh my lash did this eyeliner not come off it's crazy because the eyeliner that be like 199 be the eyeliner that stay on all fucking day all my bottom lashes are gone all my bottom lashes on this eye are gone. It's crazy. Let me hurry the fuck up. Yeah, I'm gonna request my Uber like right now. So I'm using these um, exfoliating cotton pads from Target because I'm gonna get all this eyeliner off my face. Like I'm not gonna go in there with any kind of product on my face at all. This toner that I was telling you guys about, I got it at this Korean beauty store by my house and I think it was like 26 bucks you guys could look it up online look at all that eyeliner that came off this shit will not come off like what the fuck let's request this uber and let's head out I feel like this is the cleanest my face is gonna get right now my shit is on 32% hopefully the uber driver has a charger 45 fucking dollars do not get a DUI do not get a DUI this is crazy but you know what girl math because I already paid for the facial but 45 dollars times two what the fuck? $45 there, $45 back. And then I just emailed my lawyer and told my lawyer that I... Honestly, this whole DUI shit has been nothing but an inconvenience. Like, if I'm being really, really honest with you guys. We're about to have so much fun this summer. We're going to be taking trips. We're going to be getting $500 facials. We're going to be shopping, lashes, nails, hair, boys. Girl, tell me why I just looked in the sink. It's three lashes in the sink. Just from washing my face. I lost three lashes and I just got them done yesterday. This is ridiculous. All right, y'all, let me put some pants on and then um, go get in this Uber. It's not good in here. Eventually. Well, you been here before, Yeah, fuck you. You been here before, All right, you be safe, my guy. Yeah, don't smoke too much. Okay, bye. I'm so fucking late, dog. And I'm still gonna get my facial. But I'm late as fuck. Hello. Okay, guys. So, they make you change. Let me turn the camera. Okay, so they make you change into like these little muumuu kind of like outfits. And I love it. I love it. We're gonna have a great time. Let me take my pictures. Because I'm in my influencer era. Okay. I will talk to you guys post-facial. And you will see the results. Uh. So this is what I look like immediately after my facial. Yes, she disrespected the hell out of my lace front. But it's totally worth it. I feel so good right now. I got a massage like all... <sighs> Take care of yourself. I don't know who needs to hear this, but take care of yourself. 10 out of 10, I will be coming back. And she told me that I need to do radio frequency, so I probably don't even need to get like a laser facial. I am so happy. I'm so fucking happy. Let me get dressed. I just got a $150 facial, and it was fucking worth it because I only have one face. The next facial that I'm going to get is going to be $600. I'm so hungry. I feel like it's so loud outside. I cannot believe I just got a $150 facial. Like, who am I? 
I can't wait to text my boo. Show him how I'm looking. I'm gonna get an Uber right now. What time is it? Cause I kinda wanna go get a massage. You think I should go get a massage? Or should I just eat? And my phone's gonna die. $150 facial. I'm so gagged by that. Like who the fuck do I think I am? And rent is about to be due? I'm gonna call the massage people and see what time they close. $51 to get back home. Hate this shit. I gotta clean my house. I have to clean. I need to lock in. But I don't be here. What else I was gonna tell y'all? Besides the fact that I'm so hungry, I can't even think straight and I'm starting to get an attitude. I'm so excited to eat. The facial was amazing. Definitely 10 out of 10, except for the fact that like, she did not care about my lace at all. I had it perfect too. Like, it was very much melty. I kind of feel some type of way about that, but not really because at the end of the day, like, it's not my hair. That's just what happens when you don't wear your natural hair. I'm talking, I'm talking, I'm talking because I don't want to end this video like awkwardly, but we're done here. So if you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, support your girl. You already know what to do. Get the fingers moving in the comments below and let me know if you guys want to see more vlogs. You know, we are getting more money now so we can afford to have a life. I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next video. Till next time.